gonna fly into that, aren't we? They say that the rings of Maklu 4 perpetually rain fire down upon the godless abominations that dwell below. How fun. <laughs> I'm sure it's worse than it looks, too. It is. Many of my people braved this same treacherous pilgrimage before me, never to return. Or, hang on to something! If you got it, Flark! Flark! Oh, you fool! No, no! Stabilizers are shot! Repair systems are overloaded! If we are destined to crash, try at least to crash into Fin Fang Foom! Nobody's crashing! Oh, we're crashing! These peaks are. Whoa! Flark! Just trying to slow us down! Veer! Veer! Stop yelling! Veer! Watch out for the thing, Peter! Which thing? Pretty sure she means all the things! Peter! Watch out for the thing! Yeah, I got it! Oh, Scott! Oh, Scott! Uh Can we not hit... Oh, Scott! Oh, Scott! <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean to hit that one. You want me to take the controls? No, I've got this. We're coming down hard. Head to the Okay. Oh, a little bumpy, but we're all okay, right? <laughs> <laughs> and we're laughing. That's good. It's just, it's perfect. This is us. This is how we park. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is how Quo parks anyways. <laughs> <laughs> we were not fated to die this day. Unless, of course, Fin Fang Foom devours us whole. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> oh, this is insane. This is how we park, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that definitely shouldn't be sparking. We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. <laughs> And convince Lady Albender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? Flark it. Let's do it. Now listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. Follow as I lead the melody. So traju to gluk, peldagor morgath. Soltas flounder gath. Really? We're doing this? Targath gone at coal. Vol malki ultath. Go thine coal gal mak. Targath gone at coal. Vol malki ultath. Go thine coal gal mak. Pel Mafin Sarduth, Jut Kainagul Tau, Goth and Kogal Mak. Pel Mafin Sarduth, Jut Kainagul Tau, Goth and Kogal Mak. Gal Mak, Gal. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit witches, it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me? Or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fin Fang Foom. 
And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will go for it. Okay. Well, I ain't seeing no foom poop. You should look for Katathian hunt partners. Test it. Whoa! Oh, Dark and <laughs> the legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death. Well, as long as it's glorious. We sure we'll still have a ride home with all the meteors? She can take a hit. Watch out! is falling apart. <laughs> we did not come here to be slain by ice and rocks. There is only one noble way to die on Mach 4. Like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Drax we ain't come here to die. No one's dying. We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? <sighs> Maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! All right, Drax, let's channel some of that excitement toward this rock. Uh, I shall pretend that is the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great. Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, galaxy. You have nothing to fear. They say that his bones cannot be crushed. See? I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. You can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. Does it have big, scary claws? Look, my people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories when Mantis linked us all together? They're Katathian hunt markers. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken, physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foon? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. A truly glorious death. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're a part of something here? Oh yeah! Part of Foom's all-you-can-eat buffet. I mean walking in the footsteps of Drax's people, out here to save the galaxy. Makes you want to believe in destiny. I'm not trying to kill the moment or nothing, but everybody listed here was destined to be monster chow. If we all die, we will die like proper Katathians. If we all die, everyone dies. Magus is gonna consume everything. Then let's catch Foom and make sure that doesn't happen. Russia! 
One to ten. How much bigger and stronger and scarier is Foom gonna be than the thing we just fought? Ten thousand. That's what I figured. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right. But ten thousand times Quill Drax is the literal one, remember? Obviously, our chances of pulling this off suck. A lot. But what chance does the galaxy have to do? Exactly. We all saw what the church is capable of. No matter what this planet throws at us, we're not stopping till we catch Boom and Lady Hellbender is fighting by our side. Somebody keeping an eye on the sky? Yes! It's full of meteorites. Just warn me if you see death coming from above. And you let me know if you see it coming from below. <gasps> Flark and Hala! Whoa, get a load of them claw marks. It's gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we need to cross here, too. Just not sure how. Looks like there might be a ledge hiding under all those rocks on the other side. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. How about Quill? <laughs> Come on, it's not so bad. His fleshy frame would make a poor instrument of demolition. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Crushing us all? I think I see what he's up to. Yeah, crushing us all! Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those- ah, ah, ah! Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? You mean our quarantine zone bust? Guys, this isn't just another monster hunt. It is a legendary hunt. No, I mean we're not here for the monster. Well, we are. But the monster isn't the point. Catching Foom is only step one. So what? Just because the church is probably going to destroy the galaxy if we don't pull the... Everyone get ready. There's something up ahead. I'm pretty sure it sees us, whatever it is. Great. More Foom food to deal with. Do not underestimate anything that survives the perils of this planet. Good advice. The rest of you should think of this as a warm-up for Fin Fang Boom! We don't have time for warm-up! Baker's bridge will be go off any second! Lousy crunch slurpers won't stop spinning at us! That reminds me of you when you eat! The hunt for Fin Fang Boom continues. Okay, let's just think things through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Foom, it will be an honorable final act. Eh, I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Let us hope we are not too late. All right, let's figure out a way to get through. We're in a rush, apparently. There. See? More... ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not, but smart ones do. Yeah. Too 
hollow. They say that Fin Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. Careful. That's deadly gas. How do you know? Hello? He's an assassin? I bet he's gassed all kinds of famous people. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh-huh. So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Foom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out. Power. I want full credit for you. For the last time, Drax, we're not killing Fin Fang Foom. We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. Seems complicated. <laughs> Are you neck deep in water? We're about to stare down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold this up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered your fear. Yeah, well, it ain't about the Instead of giving her foam, any chance for any ain't gonna settle for a few of these. Whatever they are! I'm thinking no! This makes so! Whoa! Did you see that? That thing is freaking nasty! <laughs> Rhapsodists will recount our glory for generations! We should get him to say these things were twice as big! <laughs> Scrooge? Loving the initiative! So trajo to cloak! Trajo to Gluck, Helda Gold Morgan, Sultan Flanders Gang. This is definitely in Drax's wheelhouse. Don't leave me hanging. Trajo to Gluck, Helda Gomada, Sultan Thunderga. Anyone ever tell you, you got an enchanting voice? Are you goofed? I'm not being mean, I'm serious. <laughs> nice! Who won't know what hit him? You will be more resilient than a boulder, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just trying to be positive. Why? I think it's a team building thing. We require no further team building. We are the perfect team. Honestly, after everything we've been through, there's no one I'd rather be doing this with. I farkin' love you guys. Whoa! Farkin' Maklu! Maklu 4, Peter Quill. You must be fair to the other Maklu's. Legendary teeth and claws of Fin Fang Foo. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if he doesn't live up to all the hype. Peter, look! There's smoke ahead. Think it's Foom? More likely it's people. Great. Maybe they'll know where he is. Or they'll attack us on sight. I could probably infiltrate the camp, look for weak links, make an example of the right person, bleed them out in front of their crew. The shock of it will cause confusion, or maybe even surrender, and we carve through the rest. Hey, uh... Is everything okay? We didn't really talk after your, um... The killing my sister thing? Yeah, and other tangential topics. I'm fine. Ish. Okay. <sighs> Peter, there's a good chance Nikki's already lost. No. 
I don't accept that. And if she is, I know I'll be the one expected to make the hard call. She's my daughter. But I'm the killer. We both know that. It's not gonna come to that. And if it does? If it's a choice between her and literally everything else, Peter, you'd do anything for someone you care about. And we both know that I... We both know that you would as well. Which is why you're exactly who I need to bring my girl home. Alive. I hope you're right. Galmark! Galmark! Solta Flander! Boom! It's boom! Yes! Keep going, keep Just going! Just you fucking rock! Yes! Yeah, Ominous is right! Here goes! Watch out! That's a lot of death spikes! It's a good thing my skin is so resistant! Fin Fang Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth, purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. Ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? <laughs> oh, yeah. I like this one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Melt that one, too. Fortune smiles upon us this day, my friends. We just almost got crushed by a giant meteor. Indeed. Almost. He's got you there. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. What is that? Come on, Rocket. We got past your fear of water. I can't jump. It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You don't really strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magical. That rock tried to murder us, so we'd have never got Quill's sweet new power. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltonator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? PD Hot Guns. No! Captain Fireball. It's not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glob. Captain Heat Glob. Nope, no. no. I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh yeah, the zipper. Man, I gotta fix that thing.
Heave it, Groot. I am Groot. That's good. At least it ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Groot's practically naked. Groot don't get cold. Where'd they go? What the flark? It might be his name. Maybe he's trying to communicate. Please don't. Where'd he go? See? He just wanted to. Now we know they're all around us. Ch check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on top. Ah! It burns! Root says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Those things grow in a frozen hellscape. I think they're made of sturdier stuff than that. Burn, baby, burn! Haha, <laughs> it's nice. I ain't ever gonna get tired of that. Maklu 4 is beautiful, its own twisted way. The trees are indeed twisted, well observed. Groot says the plants here are all mean or stupid. Look, Will, it's your new best bud. I'd say communication has failed. Another up there. Where'd he go? For food. As long as we ain't what feeds them! They remind me of the abominable snowman! They are indeed abominable! Ah! A good fight warms the blood! I still don't know how you do this shirtless! Meet a nice local? Perhaps they are more amenable with time. They ain't that smart if they're fighting us! Melted the abominable snowman! Oh, and you giant run freaks do we gotta take out! These beasts serve as sustenance for food. As long as we ain't what feeds them. What you want? Looks like you yeah. survive these conditions. Well, I hope they like dying in them. No wonder they're grumpy. Living on this hunk of ice. <laughs> Maybe this is what we'll become if we stay! Okay, I'm done playing with the snow monkeys. Wendigo. they go? Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling when to go. See? Maybe Hellbender will want to add some of those Wendigo to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge. Hey, they started it. 
Seek revenge. Think that wreck is the camp we saw? Nah, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side of it. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. Alright, group, give me a boost. About yay high. Yay is not a unit of measurement. Groot knows what he means. They say Fin Fang Foom is a foe unlike any one could imagine. I mean, he's basically a dragon from the fairy tales on Earth. All right, heads up. I'm gonna drop something down for you guys. Look out below! Ha! Battle work! You think those creatures were using the 
this ship for shelter? Screw them, they're dead. These snow beasts have whet my appetite. I am eager to slay the great Fin Fang Fu. Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke. More hostiles. Maybe it's just a nice warm fire and some cigar and spirits. Ooh, maybe it's a barbecue. What's barbecue? What? You guys have never had barbecue? Charbroiled burgers, grilled steaks, baby back ribs? Why would you consume the ribs of an infant? Told you Terrans were barbaric. No, it's not. Trust me, you guys have got to try it. Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Was all this foom? Undoubtedly. Survivor. Who goes there? No head. She has no head. I believe that repulsive tentacle orb is her head. And I can hear you with it. Are you the only survivor? Clearly not. Who are you, Meat Sacks? We're here for film. Forget what I said. Yeah, I'm the only survivor. Or will be. I take it you know where we can find him? Sure. Digesting my men back at his roost. Big Eyes Obelisk sticking out of the Caldera's frozen sea. Don't worry, we'll take care of Foom. Sure you will, Terran. Just don't come running back here when he chases you. we have still got some things to pack up. Are you gonna be okay? I don't need your pity, Terran. I'll head back to Contraxia and lick my wounds. Ooh, hey, you may not want to do that. Contraxia isn't exactly safe right now. <laughs> when is it ever? Seriously, maybe you should just come with us. I've been embarrassed enough today without taking help from a stranger. I can look after myself. Well, if you hear people talking about a promise with a matriarch, just steer clear. I'll keep that in mind. Sorry about your men. Meh. Dead men collect no paychecks. Speaking of, aren't you the Mad Titan's daughter? What of it? Relax, I'm not looking for trouble. There was a time I'd have taken you in for the bounty. There was a time I'd have killed you for trying. <laughs> yeah, seems we've both got bigger problems right now. Um, any of you corpses mind if I help myself to your stuff? No? Well, thank you. Big ice thingy on the frozen sea, eh? I agree. You said it, buddy. Sure is a long way down. May as well put it to good use, right? They ain't using it. One shiny upgrade, nice and crafted. And it's done! It's all yours. Here's hoping we do better against Foom than this lot. Another hunt marker? This one is unclaimed. No doubt it belonged to one of these corpses. Guess they never got the chance to plan it. I have appropriated it for our own use. To herald our bravery this day, we shall mark our ultimate conquest, or our glorious defeat. Foom may be bad news, but he's nothing compared to the fight that comes next. It shall mark our penultimate conquest. One conquest at a time. All right, people. Let's catch us a dragon. Yes, we grow ever closer to our great destiny. 
You're awful, Chipper, considering Foom obliterated that camp like it was nothing. We are not nothing. I'm with Drax. No mountain too high, no valley too low. Literally. Whoa! Hey, Keith, the ice is amplifying our velocity! This is how I die! Ah! <laughs> Have you lost your fork in mind? Well, that takes care of the getting down part. I don't even want to think about how we're going to get back up. Or how we're going to get Foom up there. Look on the bright side. We may be dead. Back on Earth, people would use dog sleds. A whole line of huskies pulling a sled across the ice. Don't expect me to be the dog. I was actually thinking of the Wendigo. And Foom is the sled. Ooh, I didn't think it could get any colder. You know, it's days like these I'm glad I installed seat warmers in the Milano. Up ahead, there's the ice obelisk. This must be it, the frozen sea. This is the perfect spot. Here we will challenge the great beast. Fin Fang Foom, come and face your death. What are you doing? We can't get the drop on him if he knows we're here. Also, we're not killing him, remember? Shout with me. Here we demonstrate our metal. Fin Fang Foom! Your end draws near! Nope, not his end. Your quill, go! Uh, uh Fin Fang Foom, it's... Nap time! Oh, Rocket, it's your turn! Did he just say my real name? Rocket! Fin Fang Foom, we're gonna decomboggle your flock and scut spigots! You hear me? He hears you! You scaly, overgrown gordel splode! You fessed lump of satarki and shrub meat! You don't scare us! It feels good, does it not? Yeah! Yeah! It actually does! No! We disrobe! Yeah, we're not doing that. Hmm. My blood thickens in anticipation of our great combat. Gross. Just through here. Be ready for anything. That is technically impossible. So, uh, where is he? Maybe we spooked him. Impossible. Foom was born without fear. You don't know that. In the cold heart of a dying star. Dying stars ain't cold. This one was. You think his lair's behind that? Let's find out. Look! 
the claws! Watch the everything! Boom, baby! How you like us now? His opinion does not appear to have improved. One to go! Hope Hellbender appreciates we're going to all this trouble! Who wouldn't want a giant dragon? Nice work, Peter! Not so hot now, are you, Boom? Bring it, you overgrown lizard! Looks like he just did! Run! That was too close! Good thinking! Muscles! Give Groot a hand! He thinks you two can refund that rock right into Boom's face! Quick! Before Boom figures it out! A critical blow to the Guardians of the Galaxy! Look out below! Put the lights out! Do not hold back now! Who's been holding back? I can't believe we're fighting a dragon! What's wrong, Peter? First time? No, 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 no! Fuck that! Money-making scheme. This is not my money. Underutilized. Hey, Quill, want to see some fireworks? Feel free to give up, Boom. Fool would never save himself and surrender. Hand on a swivel. His own might will be his undoing! I can't believe we're fighting a dragon! What's wrong, Peter? First time? Let's hurry this up! I'm getting cold! Then you are not fighting hard enough, Rocket! We shall prepare our strike for food! Hope just makes a swear with Hellbender! You would do well to use her full title in her presence! Most dangerous when that is most desperate. We must not fail. 
And triumphant! Fuma's fallen! Queen of Seknarf 9, you said you'd hear him out. You promised. <laughs> Speak. <laughs> I hope this is the one where you make a good speech. <sighs> we screwed up. We conned you, robbed you, killed your baby. We can't take back what we've done. But we want to make it right. Uh, Quill. You murdered the Dragon Lord of Kakarantara! <gasps> This isn't you. the two of us together. Lord Foom. <laughs> the final harvest begins. Dead worlds screaming across space. We must go. Now. Someone needs to take a stand against the church. We could really use some help. You pay one debt, then create another? No, though I can kind of see... Enough. I will gather my forces. All right, let's go. Lady Hellbender shall fight alongside us this day. After we bested Foom, Foom the Invincible. We found Drax's peanut butter and chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> 
We are on the path to destiny, my friends. I still can't believe we did it. We did do it, right? We sure did, and we got Mantis back. <sighs> but we lost Warlock, and we'll need him to exercise the Magus once we shut down that ritual. So we bust him out of cult prison. I've done jailbreaks before, we all have. We still tracking him? <laughs> oh yeah, that thing ain't coming out easy. Good. Then all we gotta do is get there on time and hope Lady Hellbender does too. Oh, uh, she will. I'm certain of it. All right. Let's gear up, people. Tie up any loose ends. Take a pee if you have to, because we're not stopping again. <coughs> hey, Quill. Let me borrow your tunes. Why? I need the focus. Come on. Do not drop that. Mantis? What happened on Lamantis after we left? Last time we saw you, things looked dire. It's a long story. We can talk about it after you do like Star Guy says and use the bathroom. I don't need to. All right, but don't say I didn't warn you when church grandpa makes you do faith crunches. Wait, Raker's gonna do what? It depends. But at some point, someone says my name, and then there's a little bit of pee. Great. I did not want to know that. <laughs> oh yeah, little fuzzy. Maybe the little bit of pee is you. Nope. Aw, she says thank you for getting rid of Aiden Warsock. Apparently she likes me better. Uh, Adam Warlock? Yeah, him. She thinks I'm bleats. It translates weird. Mantis, I've got so many questions. I know, and I've got so many answers. Like, seize the means of production. Or, it's not just a rash. Or, yes, it is gluten-free. Uh, not the answers I was looking for, but... Now I'm wondering about the questions. What questions? How did you convince Lady Hellbender to meet us on Maklu 4? You weren't even with us when we decided to go. Actually, convincing her to go after you wasn't hard at all. But convincing her to hear you out? Woo! That was tough! I had to get all creepy mystical and spook her with warnings about what would happen otherwise. You told her about the end of the universe. And she believed you? Oh, no, not at first. But when I brought up all her precious monsters dying, she came around. Couldn't take that chance with her babies, you know? What happened on Lamentis after we left? You said some people would survive, but that doesn't fare super well for the others. Many of the Elders died. They didn't resist the invasion, but they would never accept the promise. It isn't their way. I'm sorry. Don't be. Their sacrifice bought time for me and the Kotati to hide most of the others. They will emerge when the galaxy is saved. So you were able to hide them in the caves. Hope you told them to stay away from the fog. Well, I'm glad to have you with us. Oh, good. Because you're not always glad. Why not? Well, sometimes I'm your ex-wife. What? <laughs> I think she's pulling your leg, Quill. It only ever happens the one time, but it's so funny. Good thinking. Get the watering sorted out before we go. I am Groot. <laughs> I am Groot. <laughs> <laughs> he, he looks so sad, swishing around in his robes. <laughs> the, the what? What did what, he say? <laughs> Gro Groot wants to water the Grand Unifier. Oh, right. <laughs> the soaked Unifier? <laughs> <laughs> Peter Quill, spar with me. <laughs> uh, I, I think I'll pass, Drax. I uh, don't want to get tired before the real fight. Tired? But this is the warm-up. Not a bad idea. We don't know what's going to happen when we get out of hyperspace. Raker's going down this time, Gamora. I promise you. 
And I promise you, I'm getting Nikki out of there, no matter what. We will get her out. Together. Together. Bet those moves are really going to impress Lady Hellbender. I do not need to impress her. Besting the great Fin Fang Foom is proof enough of my combat skills. Yeah, that would do it. I'm not sure Lady Hellbender was really impressed with how we handled that fight. You know, since we accidentally killed that dragon before Groot revived him. Would you not be impressed by a man slaying a dragon? Maybe if he does it without my help. Hey, uh, Bug Lady, you see anything about this mission we should know about? I don't see much. Or rather, I see too much. So many realities converging? Does late Here goes nothing. Eh, no, scratch that. Here go the Guardians of the Galaxy. Woohoo! I'm gonna barf. Smear that fleet looks twice as big now. Wrong. It is at least thrice as big. That's the biggest I've ever seen it. What now? Kill the lights, kill the engines, and wait for Lady Hellbender to show up. <laughs> We're sure she's coming, right? She is a woman of honor, a queen. She promised to gather her forces. And how long is that gonna take? Too long? No. We can't be too late. We gotta save the galaxy and Nikki. One way or another, we need to get in there and shut down that ritual. We can't take on a fleet that big. Little Fuzzy! Rocky, what are you doing, man? We need to get into Sacrosanct to disrupt the ritual, right? We all know we get killed out here. So, I'm gonna make a really loud distraction. My tunes! Yeah, I rigged it to blast your scuddy music across all channels while the church is out looking for the source. We cut the engines and we flow silently right past them to board the sacrosanct. Smart! Seriously? Fine. But we're getting it back as soon as we win. Now get back in here! Find a place to park. Our deception is working. Don't sound so surprised. We are so gonna get my music back once this is all done. Sorry, Quill. Chances are they're gonna blast it to pieces once they pin it down. Let's make sure this sacrifice counts. Can we not call it that? Guardians of the galaxy, stop hiding! The monster lords of Seknaf-9 hunger for battle! 
We're not hiding. We are sneaking. Because we need to get into Sacrosanct alive. Then we will slaughter as many as we can out here while you fight your way in. Eat, my children! Crack open their shells and feast upon the sweet meats inside! <laughs> <laughs> this is so metal. All right, people, let's take advantage of the nice lady's murdering spree. We're busting into Sacro That landing base are way in. There's still a lot of pain to be here and there. So if we can blow past it. It's risky. Direct hit. Now this is a proper dogfight. That's a hit! <laughs> Root says it's maybe better than- Crap, that's a lot of turrets. Kill him or dodge him. We gotta get through there. Hurry up, Peter! The real fun's gonna be inside Ranger Mantis, you sure you could fly her? Yes! Sometimes! Hang on, maybe you should... Two arms! The enemy approaches! Rocket, any sign of Warlock? Yeah! My tracker's going cold, but in the central rock remains. We gotta get out of this hangar! Tell them that! Have you got a brain on the weak? Don't that weirdo deserve it! Firework! Ah. Ah. Two arms! 
Certain they have not found a way to convert the warlock. It would explain why they took him prisoner instead of just killing him. And there's a lot of faith Scott beaming into this place. He almost kicked our bus when he was all sad and mopey. Warlock hates Magus. He already evicted the thing once. Maybe they made up. You booted me in Groot, but here we are. I did not. You left. My point stands. No. If Magus had turned warlock, he would have been here to greet us. She's spinning. Don't worry about my flying. Just worry about your shooting. You'll meet you people soon. Already here, Mantis. Oh, they hide for me. The Celestial Madonna sends her greeting. I kind of want to know how they made so many uniforms in such a short time. Maybe there's a giant closet on the ship somewhere. Oh, fuck! People fight without fear. They have fully embraced the promise. And there's millions more where they came from. Let's hope Mantis and Lady Hellbender keep most of them busy outside. Hey, we can get through here. Doors flarked. Scut. We need to go that way. See if you can overload it. Are they still mad at us? Okay, okay, sorry we left such a mess last time we were here. No, we ain't! Uh, imagine the havoc Lady Hellbender must be wreaking outside! Who probably crushed half the armada by now? Making sure work of these bulkish creeps! Having fun praying on the week? Think they'll tell us where Warlock is? We don't need them to! Tracker's working fine! We win! We get first dibs on all the salvage, right? Let's cross the finish line before we start dividing the spoils! Don't have Slain! Believe them! Them. Believe them. Groot's right! They started it! It's a bit cold, so they've got to have janitors. How would you restrain one as powerful as the Warlock? Oh good, here comes the cleaning crew. The spill is back that way, boy. I do not believe these people are janitors. The fabric inhibits their potential! Throw that, Drax! Imagine the havoc Lady Hellbender must be wreaking outside! Probably destroyed half the armada by now, Drax! Using only her bare hands! <laughs> Think they'll tell us where Warlock is? We don't need them to! Tracker's working fine! This faith-filled fanatic got the point! Is that what they call a spiritual experience? This has got my name on it! The fabric inhibits their potential! I am Groot! 
You said it, bud. They are gonna throw everything they got at us. And we will dodge it! Star Guy, what does the angry orange light on your controls mean? Which one? The one under the tape. Oh, now it's yellow. Now orange again. Yellow. Just ignore it, Mantis. You put tape over my warning lights? You're distracting. You just lost your tape privileges. It's my tape! Is this really the most efficient path? <laughs> Not even close. Let me guess. This is the only one where we have a chance to survive? What? You can see the timelines too? Now what? Where is he? Ah, got him. Golden Boy's this way. Come on. Yes, we're going out into space. We got no other options. And I got a theory. Yup, artificial gravity. Figured a ship this big would need it for repairs and stuff. <laughs> this is so cool. Hang on. Okay, go, go, go. See, nothing to it. Yep, signal's coming from somewhere inside that giant frickin' rock. All right, let's do this. Scrap heaps taking pot shots at our monsters. Enemies ahead, Peter Quill. Okay, we got this. Come, and test your metal. Be careful! They could try to box us in! Let him try! I'll shoot them all! Just 
space battle is frenzy! Kinda wish we were in the thick of it! You don't stand a chance! Ooh, start the shield into the fight! Enough already! Oh, you are pathetic! Let's kill this guy! I got all these toys! I'm just dying to you! Let's go! I shall enjoy this! Take care of it. Even if it means I'll take care of it. Thanks, bud. Any bets on what's down there? No. Better than being exposed up here. Guys, not too late to surrender. You will not surrender. Boss, now. Just drop your glasses and we'll call it even, okay? Right? You're not 
takes us, it will be a fatal mistake! Let's sack him! Now is our opportunity! Let's make him feel it! No fair! He's boosting everyone but us! Let's sever his ties and mind! Now is our chance! The sorcerer priest is swaying! No, these goons ain't gonna tell us what! Waste the time! Ready! Rope! Healing his pals! argument and we beat them mercilessly half expecting a monster to come crashing through the wall that would be very very bad maybe we should keep moving i would like to leave this enclosure i cannot see the battle do you mean you might miss a peek at lady hellbender and fin fang foom do you think foom holds a grudge we bested him in his own lair he will forever recognize us as his superiors yeah well he's lady hellbender's pet now and she does hold a grudge that is true. These things are built like freaking Terminators! No! We will be there, Terminators! Throw them away, Margaret! I'm going to have some long-term trust issues with robots after this! Robots should never be trusted! You have been shooting that big bot for hours! Things built tough! We need to really pile it on! Feel this? We're hoping the monsters would smash the ships away from that thing! They're just doing what monsters do! They ain't about precision! Ugh, they suck even when they're on fire. Yeah, well I like watching them burn. But now that we have conquered Foom, there are other great beasts worthy of our hunt. Brute says Planet X had a really scary monster named Goom. I've got to give you credit, Peter. Really? Your crazy plan is actually working. I never expected Lady Hellbender to show up here. I wasn't sure we were ever gonna find Foom. Ah, we did that, not just me. You're the one who brought us all together. And kept us together. Again, sir, better j Okay, who's ready for some action? Rocket, tell me we're almost through this. Uh, we're further than we were the last time you asked. Mark! Don't blame me, I'm just the guy with the tracker. Control the walkway! Split them up! Hurt them my way! Climb it out of big guy! Get down here! Let me shoot you! Like a hot knife! Perhaps we can help Lady Helmet to put you in! No need to show off, big I see it! Get the point! Whoa! Wendy's on our side! Peter Quill's child! That one! The breathing room, Ain't she leaving them now? And ready! 
Let's get tactical! What's next, Peter? Ain't these freaks never heard of tram? We would be easy targets in a tram! Onto these fools! Help, Rex! Take out the Centurion! He's struggling! Light him up, Rocket! Return to the first child at once! Vegas has her in its control! We gotta kill it first! Coming! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah. That was just so... Metal? Yeah. Glad you got your music back, Will. You were the one who chucked it into space. Hey, it worked, didn't it? No harm done. Psychological harm was done. Ah, careful, it's still hot. We gotta get through this. Gamora, I got snip, this. Snip. Back into a hole. Great. Like holes. Crap, giant robot. I hate these things. Not even sure it is totally robot. What does that mean? It's running on base energy, right? That runs on the Quill! Also has been trouble! You're glad we've got a monster queen watching out for us. She knows how to make it out You just met with the rock and rock here. Everything will die! we're barely denting this thing! Returned your device! Did she mention my name? Is now really the time? Thanks, Will! Mulberry's got Round herself in a bind! On it! Ouch! That's gotta hurt! Another engine droid is also a sizable threat! <laughs> Think those things have people in them? It wouldn't be the weirdest thing we've seen. They're creepy either way. Come on, we gotta go topside again to reach Warlock. Leave this to me! We survived this. We should invite Lady Hellbender to join the team. Uh, there ain't no room for her on the ship. She's like three quills high. One and a half quills, at best. Her armor alone must weigh six quills. You know what? Let's vote on it. Do we invite Lady Leotard? Nope. Yes. No. Nope. Your quill. Groot. Your votes. 
She probably still wants to murder me, so I'm gonna be a no. In her defense, that describes most people. That's fair. Groot's a number two. Voters have decided. I have been overruled. Incoming! <laughs> now that was unexpected. Fortune favors us. We were not sucked into the lethal void. Unless Raker shuts off the gravity. Just have to hope he's too busy with the ritual to think of it. Are we sure Warlock's all the way over on the other side? Yeah. As long as we keep moving forward, we're going the right way. We have found purpose. We will not die here. If we do, we will see you on the top. The correction. I will see you on the top. The rest of you will see whatever heathen paradises you believe in. Where are you going, Quill? Just following my gut on something. Perhaps Lady Hellbender will join us in our final battle against the Magus. Something tells me she's got her hands full. They are large hands. Strong hands. Now where the flark is he going? It's called scouting, okay? It's a shame Lady Hellbender didn't have this kind of army to back us during the Galactic War. She's building her legacy. We are fortunate to have her now. Yeah, let's stay on her good side. We're almost there. Is that you in there? Da. Spasiba, Guardian of Galaxies, for helping Cosmo shake away promise. He is no longer chasing stick that is snake. And look, Cosmo is bringing no Yeah, we noticed. And family. Say privet, my pops. Oh, it's good to have you back, buddy. Ha! Cosmo is very much like filthy fleas. You are thinking he is gone. Until he is biting on your ass. Boom! He's such a good boy. Yet, Cosmo is best of boys. Boom! Boom! Now we give these brain fleas the bites they deserve. Attack! I had no idea nowhere could fire death beams! This is sweet! And that dog has his paw on the nuke button. It's gonna have to be nicer to him. We should keep moving. We are moving. Well, we should be doing it faster. <sighs> Once we get inside that rock, chances are we're gonna have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Grand Unifier again. We'll stomp on his toes. I've only got one of his arms. I'm dying to complete my collection. Wait. What's that? Signal is way stronger in here. We're getting close. 
We're here for Adam Warlock. Scream your voice and we'll let you go. They ain't listening. Hard to believe these tunnels used to be filled with miners instead of freaks. Idiots could have been rich if they stuck with it instead of following some stupid cults. Are we late for the fulfillment again? Anything feel different? Pretty sure Magus is gonna devour our souls. We probably feel that. Somewhere. Doesn't feel like the ideal spot for the fulfillment to me. Brace yourself! I was just trying to wake him up! Been too long since I blew something up! If we don't stop Magus this time, it's all over! Magus will regret its trespass! Not it! Well, combatants, Peter Quill. Will you attempt to reason with them as well? It won't work. Just put them down! Broke another caucus! We are lucky that Mantis can read the future! Mantis will make a great guardian! Just saying! Let's keep pushing. The signal's pinging from deeper in the mines. Hard to believe this whole church sprung up from a bunch of miners. Wish they stuck to digging. Our opponents do not hold back. They think we're trying to keep them out of paradise. Somebody's still digging down here. I'm betting they use these precious metals for the face tech. The Grand Unifier's golden pajamas don't come cheap. Oh, Wish we had a way to take some of this ore with us. Ain't nobody training that scut once the church is gone. Too risky. Feels like I've been shooting that big butt for hours. We need to focus on taking it down. in open space. If you're attacked unprovoked, you have the right to claim the battle spoil. We have definitely provoked them. They provoked us first. Lots of time. Look, you love that. Is it me or are we barely denting this thing? It is as venerable as it is large. We must prepare yourself. This is going to be our last chance. Trespass! Bust out the smart box! Praise the time, man! Mass! Are we even putting a dent in the sky? Great idea, bud. If we pull this off, we should come back here and fill up our cargo hold. Sell the ore on the black market? Payment for a job well done? Seems fair to me. Well, we ain't making that jump. Peter's got this. He does? Peter Quill possesses the magical weapons. We are safety inspectors. Present your documents and we will judge them. Oh, I safety inspectors! Blam! You failed! Blam! You have failed your safety inspection. They're dead, Drax. Correct. You know what to 
can do, Quill. He says he wishes his people could have lived to see him save everything. This old workbench is kind of crusty, but I do some of my best work with crusty tools. It is a shame Lady Hellbender did not send some. What the? Hey, look, they get the Adam Warlock channel all the way out here. Speaking of Goldilocks, he should be right on the other side of that giant murder bot army. You've got to be kidding. They've got it locked down with a faith shield. Think we can unplug it like we did on Nowhere? It's worth a shot. Let's push through this, people. Don't want to keep the Golden God waiting. Scott, that power's dropping box! That warrior is killing me! Scott, Scott back! Put him down hard! So this is where they build the big boys! Man, I hope they don't all wake up at once! Toss him around! Man, that giant ah. robot can take a lot of pain! We need to really pile it on! He's freezing harder while he's juicing him! Our enemies grow stronger! Rocket! Blast him! Oh. We should find the warlock! Two lives beyond that magical barrier! We must focus our attention there! Oh. Come on, put him down! Close! We must quash the fulfillment! No! They're waking up! Good! Do your thing, Max! Ah! A warrior does not waste time fighting machines! A warrior fights whatever's trying to kill them! Is it me or are we barely denting this thing? Right? 
Yeah, just gotta get access to them first. Where's Warlock? Shouldn't he be in here? Guess these guys didn't get party invites. That did it! down to gold cheeks. Make sure you grab on good. The drone, not the cheeks. Grand unifier. Scott, everyone down. Finally come to confront the captive. Castigate him for how far he's fallen. Shut your mouth for once. A clear shot. Don't. We can't risk a fight from up here. You show up on the very eve of our ascension. To what? Take everything from us once again? Me? Tell me what I ever took. My faith! And not just mine. You abandoned your flock. The very church you helped me build. You let us believe our God was dead. And with you, any hope of restoring those we lost. I thought that... You promised me, my son! I promised only partnership. You sought subjugation. My mistakes were many, but your mania is not among them. Enough! Enough of this! The true divine vessel awaits. You're nothing but a husk, a faded shadow. But even you will feel the light. Hear me. Halt this horror. Raker! Guardians, breach my bindings. Even now, Raker readies his restoration ritual. Rocket, can you bust him out? If I gotta... Let me guess. Raker's power proved more pernicious than predicted? There is little point pondering possibilities past. Daughter of Thanos, soon feverous faith will flood Raker's fledgling and feed the fiend within. Not gonna happen. We're gonna shut it down together. Right? Okay, let's go, people. Come! Time dwindles as we dawdle. I could put him back up there. Don't tempt me. If Magus finds physical form, its insatiable cravings will consume all of creation. Unless you eat Magus first. A severe simplification. We must excise the entity gripping the girl. But how much of Nikki will remain? If her light lives, it lingers lost, dissolving in a dream discarded. A pleasant dream. Magus camped out in your head for way longer than Nikki, and you see. Well, end of the world here, remember? Hurry, go! Rejoice! You made it just in time for the miracle. Grand Unifier, I trust you can hold them to bear witness. Easily.
lady! Push through your pain! Fulfill the promise! Monster! Mantis... Mantis, where... I will skin you! Group, see if you can... I need your help. Mom will be home for lunch soon, and I want everything to be perfect. Uh, Nikki. For her birthday. That's today. Did you forget again? Listen to me, okay? None of this is real. Are you kidding? Dad! You promised you'd help me surprise Mom for her birthday. No, I didn't. Yes! You said you'd help fix the hollow projector, and the cake still needs candles, and I can't find the present we got her. Oh, come on, Nikki. <laughs> None of this seems oddly familiar to you? Oh, no. I ordered it from the bakery plant. Okay, that part was always weird. No! I baked it! Okay, that just leaves the present and projector. Dad, the projector? Wonder how great you'll think I am after I destroy this nightmare. Okay, Nick? What if I told you none of this is real? Uh, obviously not. It's not focused right or something. Can you refocus it? Yeah, okay. That's still pretty cool. It turned out so good. I was sure I messed part of it up. Speaking of messed up... Yeah. It's hollow, and the star system around it, and I think I got all the moons. It's beautiful, Nikki. Just need Mom's present now. I think it's somewhere in my room. Happy birthday, love, Nikki and Peter. What am I supposed to do? Did you find it? Yes! Okay, put it with the others. Great! The gift. Put it on the table. Does anything I say here actually matter? We got it. On Nowhere. Remember the artist's alley we went to and the painting she really liked? Of Krilar? Guess that answers my question. Any chance we can talk now? I don't think so. How does it look? Looks like you're knee-deep in this promise. Thanks, Dad. I love you. Oh, boy. Peter, open the door. It's Mom. I'll make sure everything's perfect. You get the door. Oh, am I ever glad to see you. It is crazy weird in there. Nikki's on a loop. Nothing I say matters. We need to find a way to get through to her. Peter. I know, I know. We need a plan. There's no we. Okay, I get it. I have a lot of making up to do. Peter. But if we're gonna do this... I'm dead, Peter. Yeah, but... Not like dead, dead. 
right? I heard your voice. No, you brought me here. I'm seeing you here now. You're seeing a ghost. Some part of me is inside the soul stone, but not in any way that's real. We can figure it out. Maybe we can no. find a way. You need to focus on her now. Help her accept that I'm not coming back. I just... I wish you would have told me. Told you what? About Nikki. You know? You, me, 12 years ago. Oh, Peter. I did the math. Her promise isn't real. Yeah, I know, but the rest of it is. Right? You and me on Mercury? I remember that night. So do I. But she isn't your daughter. She's not my daughter. I don't understand. She's a war orphan. On the shuttle home, the Cree Council was rounding up anyone who wasn't full-blooded enough. Nikki was this... Tiny little thing. I couldn't let them kill her. So I'm not a father. No. Well, not her father. Well, you okay? That doesn't mean she doesn't need you. She has to let me go. I tried. She won't listen. She has to. The birthday, the presents, whatever it is that's keeping her attached to some fake version of me, of us. Destroy the illusion and make her listen. You know I'm not equipped to. Yes, you are. You have to be. I know. Where's Mom? That was her, right? She's not coming. Of course she's coming. I guess that was just... just Carlos telling us she's running late. Which means I still have time to get the music just right. Destroy the lie. Destroy the lie, Peter. Any moment now. Please listen to me on this, Nikki. Can we talk about this after Mom's birthday? Your mom's not coming. None of this is real. Quit kidding around. She'll be here any minute. No, kiddo. She won't. Stop trying to ruin it. With you. I'm sorry, Nick. No! I can fix this. Stop it! Stop it! Stop ruining this! Mom will still come. It's not real, Nikki. None of this is real. I hate you! You're not my dad! You're not my... Yeah, kiddo. I know. You ruined it. You ruined everything. Mom was gonna come in and, and... All I want is to see her. Whatever walks through that door... won't be your mom. You don't know that. Well, there's a lot I don't know. How to keep my foot out of my mouth. How to not get arrested. How to console a 12-year-old whose very legitimate grief might just destroy the galaxy. But this... The promise, Nick. I know a con when I see one. 
This isn't about you. Why are you even here? Mitch, I remember feeling this cavernous... I don't care how you felt! Wow, um... That was brutally honest. I've seen your promise. I've seen hundreds of thousands of promises. None of them helped me. I know. I know. I just want you to know that I've been through some version of what you're going through. Yay! I need her back. I don't care if it's not real. I need things to go back to how they were, even if it means making the same stupid game for all stupid eternity. Just the thought that she might come back is better than admitting that she never will. And that... And then it's all my fault. If I hadn't distracted her... If I'd been quicker... You're not the reason she's gone, Nick. Don't put that on yourself. Why not? It's true. If I had just... It's not true. You didn't make that thing. You didn't release it. You're not the reason your mom was where she was. There's a lot of blame to go around, but there is no way you deserve any of it. It could be her. Only you can reject the lie, Nick. All I can tell you is me. I don't think it's her. I think it's a very bad thing that wants to eat the entire galaxy. And you know your mom? For all her faults? Was not the galaxy eating type. But it doesn't matter what I think because it's not my promise. I can't destroy it for you. So let's just say that the creepy thing at the door is not my mom. I can do that. I still don't know how... How does anyone... Am I just supposed to smash cakes all day? <laughs> Breaking stuff is pretty cathartic. There's other ways. What are you doing? It's an earth thing. My mom taught me. The idea is that you light something to remember someone. To pay tribute. I mean, it's not magic or anything. It doesn't bring anyone back, but... You know, it's, it's a gesture. A small thing in the face of a very bad thing. Sometimes that's all we have. Thinking back to the elevator, when she was angry at me. Not that angry. More like, uh, lovingly concerned. Hey. Whatever happens. You're not alone, okay? There is something I do have to do alone.
must return! Focus on Raker's fan club. Oh. 
Not waver! Please. It lied to you. 
to both of us. Look at it. Really look. <sighs> My child. You did it. You brought him back. <laughs> Behold before you, your benevolent guardian of the galaxy. <laughs> it is done! Okay, okay, we'll give you this one. Shall we? Our adoring masses await. So, we actually won? Fucking right we did. We must save the entire galaxy more often. Count me in. Next time, I, I promise I won't almost destroy it first. No more promises from you. <laughs> <laughs> We're in this moment, people. Let's make sure we bask in it. There you are, you old dog. We have multiple dog report items to discuss. Case is closed. No need. Guardian of Galaxies. Live up to name. They had some help. Oh, gosh! Who are all these little guys? If Guardian are looking for more work, Cosmo always chasing problems. I think what we need right now is a nice walk. Me delicate? <laughs> and who is this precious little candy in his golden wrapper? <laughs> you, Rose. Uh, I, uh, Lady Hellbender, we regret the death of so many great beasts, but we honor their sacrifice. They died protecting their pack. There is honor in that. Will you return to Seknarf 9? We must first build a worthy home for Foom, or he will devour every creature on my world. If he gets loose again, give us a call, and we can discuss rates. Do 
you remember anything about what happened here? Galactic scale party. No expenses spared. Pretty tacky, though. And way too loud. Wait, is that Drax the... It is simply Drax. And that... By Halla, that's Gamora! Celebrity guests, you missed a legendary performance. What? What, wild beast? <laughs> what foul fluid? Foolish, fickle creature! Uh, behold, one of the other guardians of the galaxy. I am Groot. What did he say? Yeah, that'll show you to your room. Except we don't got a spare room, you big lug. I am Groot. What? No. Flark, no. Hey, Groot, you give her yours. I got a lot of important scud in mind. I'm glad it's this ending, and not the really sad one. How many sad endings were there? Ugh, a lot. Oh. <sighs> Please proceed. Ah, you go ahead. No need. I insist. No, I insist. Please, proceed. This pointless pageant of politeness plagues our progress. Which is why you should go first. Very well. I will voyage through the vexing vestibule. Sky's the limit, I guess. Clearly it is not. We could rob a bank. We are broke. No! I, I am not robbing a bank. That's illegal. And super fun. You are corrupting the child. Relax, Drax. It's a suggestion. A potentially really lucrative suggestion. <laughs> you okay there, Gold Bond? It is irritating indigestion. Nothing of note. Okay. Well, there's a bathroom in the back if you need it. So, Mantis, now that the universe is safe again, what are you gonna do? I don't know. I guess I'll go back to Lamentis. Although, I hear Earth is really nice this time of year. Ooh, maybe I'll go check out Contraxia. You can gamble there. Uh, shouldn't we give Contraxia a bit of time to, you know, unpromise? Either way, it is no place for a child. <laughs> Seriously, man. Oh, you don't look so good. Where's the first aid kit? I have basic field training. <laughs> we do not own a first aid kit. <laughs> what are you talking about? We have a first aid kit. Engine tape doesn't count. He probably just needs some ginger <laughs> ale. Don't worry about little old me. I feel simply... Fabulous. Oh, come on! I... am... ETERNAL! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is even... Whoa! The Flark? <laughs> Magus, 
yeah, this is the one where Golden God Guy is consumed by the bad thing and tries to destroy the galaxy. And probably succeeds. Why does it feel like Bug Girl's inside my head? I'm inside all of your heads. This way, Magus can't overhear your super amazing plan. Which is? Oh, no. It's better if it comes from you. Him. Me. Destiny makes three. And we're all gonna die. My final form. The new norm. The stone. But that thing attacked my mom and me. It was terrified of the stone. Yes, I too have sensed its fear of the stone. Oh, yes! The ancient stone! One of the six! It's the only thing strong enough to contain the all-powerful soul of Magus! Oh, 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 okay, uh, so we just gotta get him uh, closer and then throw a magic rock at him? Exactly. Tiny, whiny, vexing specks. Woohoo! What are you all up to? Mantis, how do we lure in the big bad? It's time to kneel before the new ID. By doing what you do best, Guardians. <clears throat> nah, not being friendly. I think she means aggravating people. If anyone can piss off a god... It is us. <laughs> <laughs> do it! Kneel and revere your god. For who better to oversee? <laughs> Bravo! Bravo! You're applauding him. I'm clapping ironically. Does he know it's ironic? <laughs> yes! Applaud your god. Nope. You grant nothing but lies and false promises. Then why are you clapping? For mocking you, idiot! What? I said kneel! Oh, Swar! Are you kidding me? Stand back! I got this! Nikki, yeah. no! Get out of there! Trust me! Yes! This is right! This is the way! Cool. 
magical things. Magical guns, remember? <laughs> Such dimwit grit. Why not just submit? The stone! You must use the stone! He's still too far away. Seems like he's hanging back on purpose. What are you waiting for, Quill? Say something to throw him off. Yes, infuriate him with your carelessly chosen words. Beleaguered brats, like little gnats, gnawing on nothing because nothing. Cat, bat, muskrat, Matt. You can rhyme. We get it. Seriously, how is it possible for you to have gotten even more obnoxious? Cat, bat, splatty, splat, splat. Quadro, Matt. You begin to annoy me. It's what we do. Combat, format, diplomat. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense. Ah! We don't make sense? Ever since we met you, you've been nothing but a giant pile of word vomit. And now you gotta rhyme everything too? Inconsequential ingrates! Okay, pretty sure we derailed him. Ah! He's doing the planet thing! Nikki, you ready to save our butts again? Just be careful! Hey, I'm the one with cool powers now, remember? It's definitely growing on me. Well done, child. Okay, I definitely think we're getting to him. We just gotta hold out a little longer. Your resistance is a crime against the new divine. Heads up! More of those little freaks! Flark in space, please! Oh, you lost it! Shot. Submit to me! I said submit! Now, Star Guy! It has to be now! Time to get it through your oversized skull! We don't give in to anyone! I mean, seriously, have you met us? That's right! We're the Guardians of the Galaxy! We have business cards! And we'd rather die than submit to you! You dare defy a god? Have you no notion of my... Oh, shut up! What did you say? She said you're the worst! Your mockery mocks my very...
Peter Quill! Ah! Uh. Fuck. The stone's gonna fry you, Quill! Like it did the first time! Just run! He's got to be okay. Right, Mantis? The important thing is that he did it. You all did. This was not his sacrifice to make. Get paid? <laughs> Not yet, but. Does this mean it's over? Like over, over? The Magus is contained for now. The most insatiable entity in the galaxy is once again a prisoner of the Soul Stone. All that is left is determining what to do with it. Sell it. Destroy it. Those are both terrible ideas. <laughs> he says we should combine both ideas. Stone is neither bomb nor bauble, and not yours to bear. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He just tried to kill us and eat the galaxy. You cannot contain this calamitous force. I created it. I am its keeper. No one can keep that thing. Mantis, the chances of the galaxy being consumed again if we keep the stone? Very high. And if we give it to Goldilocks? Not as high. The child was correct. That perhaps the pull of its power would one day split my lone soul asunder. But I am not alone. Uh, just to be sure, the chances of the bad galaxy thing happening if we sell the stone? Astronomically high. The best way to make sure the Magus doesn't get out again is to make sure together. You know, the second you feel any indigestion, I shall call upon your crew. Motley though you may be, I fear we've fallen friends. And I accord my atonement for the trying to kill you and eat the galaxy. A momentary misstep. Yeah, well, sorry for... All the mean stuff we said about you. <laughs> if the mark of a man is to be bridled, none other than he himself must be mandated to toil as... Does he seriously always talk like this? I mean only to say... We're good. It's just that... I'm not the one you gotta convince. Oh, certainly not. Certainly, yes. Well? Oh. Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now I'm convinced. 